Good morning, everybody. It is Sunday, May 17th, and the 17th vlog. And today, as you just saw in the intro, it is very nice outside. So this morning, I'm going to try and get my editing done from the last two days, so Friday and Saturday. I took a day off yesterday to try and just get away from the vlogging editing for a day. So I'm gonna to try to smash those out this morning so then um, I can get out and do stuff outside. So yeah, we'll check in later after the editing's done. And sort of the plan, tentative plan today is to get out and get the stuff for my wife's birthday present. Uh, maybe start working on that and then I want to fix the barbecue today. Yeah, we'll check into you guys, with you guys later. See ya. I am waiting for some stuff to process for my editing that I'm doing. So I decided I'm going to Swiffer, Jet Swiffer, the floor down here. Because uh, as you would have saw yesterday, I uh, cleaned everything up up here. I swept, but I never did uh, a good scrub. So I'm going to do that now. We'll jump to it now. That's all cleaned up. I've edited two videos this, so far this morning and they're, I think, yeah, they're both produced now. And uh, I'm gonna go get some breakfast and then I think after breakfast I might have and go do some stuff. Um, we'll check in later. All right, folks, we are in, or I'm in the car and as you can probably see, hopefully, you saw that it's uh, 20 degrees out right now and the sun's not even out at the moment it's kind of cloudy patches or periods but it's very nice outside so I'm gonna go and try to pick up some supplies for the present for my wife and then come home and start working on it so we'll see you after that hey everybody back home um, this trip wasn't quite too successful somewhat successful but not uh, fully i did get the major thing i don't know if you can see that there um however i didn't get the paint that i need for it so um it was just too crazy lineups like it's such a nice day here it's like the first really really nice day and it's a long weekend so people are definitely just getting stuff so they can do stuff outside they're buying things to do stuff outside so which is good it's good that uh, people are buying stuff but uh i wasn't gonna wait half an hour to get into a store to buy a quart of paint <laughs> so hopefully it won't be as crazy tomorrow um and i will work on this project tomorrow and uh, i'll work on the barbecue this afternoon the evening kind of thing um, because yeah, I've got all the stuff I need to do for that, so shouldn't be too bad. So I'll uh, next time you'll see me is be doing that. So we'll check in with you later. All right, folks, I'm gonna go try to fix my barbecue, and here is me doing that. Hey guys. All right. The barbecue fix was kind of a fail. <laughs> I uh, I did get some stuff done with the barbecue, but not really what I wanted to get done. Or that wasn't the main goal for this afternoon. Um, so first I cleaned the grill racks. Actually, I didn't first, I took them out first 
And then I took the uh, burner protectors and took them out. I cleaned the burner collector or protectors first because um, they got a bunch of grease and stuff. And the reason why I was, and then I cleaned the racks as well. But the reason I did that is because I got to get into sort of the base of the barbecue to try to um, bolt uh, the top to the bottom. <laughs> And so, um, so yeah, I cleaned that stuff. That took me like an hour to clean. And I went through like half a bottle of Dove because it was so greasy. Um, I think I cleaned the, um, the burner, uh, protectors, um, in the fall when the barbecue first fell and broke, but it, uh, I'm just gonna, Close these. Neighbors below us typically have fires in the evenings, and uh, the way we are is the smoke comes right into our house if our windows are open. But uh, yeah, anyway, where was I? Oh yeah, I cleaned the the uh, racks and the uh, burner protectors, and I did the burner protectors in the fall when it broke um but i haven't cleaned the racks in a very long time um we've it's a stainless steel barbecue so everything lasts forever so you, there's it's not like you but you just if it lasts forever but you gotta clean it um eventually um so spend an hour doing that that was uh, quite intense and it didn't really it might have got 50 percent of the grease that's caked onto the, the stuff but uh anyway Got through that, and then I um, started to do the real job I was trying to get done today. <laughs> and I realized that the brackets I bought, the bolts don't fit through them. <laughs> and then, so what I had to essentially drill into the bolt or into the brackets to try to make a big enough hole for the, the bolts. That took me a while. Um, I basically ruined a drill bit, but they're bits I never use. So, and they came with like a old drill um, that I like. It was like a box battery uh, powered drill that isn't the best. So I've never used those bits before. So I thought, mm, why not? If it breaks them, if it ruins them, whatever. Um, got through that, and then I was like, okay, well, let's try with these bits to get through the stainless steel. And those bits do not go through stainless steel. I've got to come up with another solution um, and figure that out before I can really bolt it. Um, yeah. And to top it all off, my time lapse didn't work, so I couldn't. I didn't. I don't have anything to really show for the uh, me working on the barbecue. So yeah, that's where that's at. Um, and yeah it was but one thing i did fix so the first time the barbecue fell it kind of broke the top piece not broke it but just bent it and when that happened the grill protectors that uh or not the the burner protectors they didn't really fit very well after that happened anyway i got in there and i bent some of the metal back <laughs> on the back side of the barbecue and now they fit and they don't fall down on the burners. So that was a plus. <laughs> Gotta take some pluses out of this <laughs> stuff I did today. Um, but uh, yeah, it's gonna be another day before I fix that, which kind of sucks. Cause I thought I was, I was pretty determined that I was gonna be able to drill through the stainless steel with whatever bits I had. I didn't really think too much of it and uh, yeah, once I get that done, it, it's gonna work. I, I measured everything out. The bolts are just big enough. The bolts will work. I've got washers um, and nuts that will will work. It will it, it will just work. So, um, but I just gotta get big enough holes <laughs> through the stainless steel to uh, make that work. But uh, anyway, that's pretty much all for tonight. I'm um, guessing we've, we're going to make some hot stickers tonight and we'll probably just relax. I don't think I'm going to do a workout tonight. Uh, 
I'm pretty exhausted. And I think I might try to go for a run tomorrow. So, I don't know. I, actually, I don't know. I'll probably still do my workout tonight. It's only 15 minutes of work. Whatever. Just do it, right? Um, so, yeah. Here's my workout right now. Hey everybody, um, after my workout last night, I for, went straight to bed. I forgot to uh, do an outro, so here it is. Um, this is the end of the vlog for May 17th, 17th vlog. Um, hopefully you liked my workout and hopefully um, you liked this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. If you're liking my content, please subscribe and we'll see you guys tomorrow.